Hello boys, good day. So, we will start uh, playing with our uh, Gilles Vicente, as you can see we are on the 1st January. I mean, nothing I can do, I can maybe try to look for additional scout or something like that, but I think for this season it's not required, my money still is the same, nothing changed. So, we will just continue playing, as you can see I have few suspensions. So we will see who can play the next game. Next game is actually Braga in 8 days. So let's go forward. In the meantime I need to uh, try to now connect everything so we can go live on the Twitch. Yesterday, I mean yesterday when we played with uh, with this team, uh, results was actually excellent. I mean I have some draws, but still we managed to beat Porto in a way in the cup. What is actually good, and now we need to play two home games against Braga. One is domestic league, another one is the cup. So Porto is already out of title race, now it's Sporting and Befica still chasing me. But you see, we have a really hard schedule. When I can win the Champions League with this team, uh, not sure. Season 2, next one, I think it's impossible. I will not have enough money to buy the players what I like, or even on the loan, depends. Probably I can be contender in the season after, in the third season. Just because the reputation of this league. Areza is still out. So we have a few issues. This guy is suspended, suspended. And this guy is now on African Cup. Okay, this and this guy cannot play. That means that means I'm fucked. I'm really fucked. Because I don't have nobody who can play as a right back. Hmm. Not easy situation. Not even central defender. I need to use the guy with low morale. Uh, okay. If we don't have the player, then we will try to to check this under. Oh, we have Pedro Alves. We will promote him and he will play. Let me add a Not ideal situation, but what we can do? Nothing. So let's hope we can score more than what we will concede. <laughs> Simple.
Some easy goals will be nice from set pieces in this game. Luckily they missed. What is the worst? Their best player is playing as a left winger and my worst is there. This is the clear chance we need to score. We are fully controlling the game. Yeah. Regarding right winger, as I mentioned, crossing is important together with the speed. And again, if you can get the player who has good finishing composure and long shot, he can also score the goals because he will come in opportunities. Something I fuck up here. Two subs uh, for this guy. Can he play right winger? Uh, no. I will just remove tackle harder. Come on. I mean, they have this fucking Vitinha, he always scores. Especially, you see, I'm missing central defender and uh, right back in this game. So I need to score at least one more. The goal from a corner would be nice if possible. Chance. 
Come on. Come on, boys. One more goal. Fucking goalkeeper. I think I'm having, uh, I think, 10 shots on the target. And now I get a red card. They might play without right winger or see him on attack. Because this guy will get fucked. You see who I'm playing on the right side. I don't have nobody due to suspension. I will sacrifice one midfielder and give me give me penalty or something. I need I need to score one goal. I will concede until end. I am sure about that one. He is also in the situation to get another card. <laughs> Fantastic goalkeeper save boys I, can I do some sub? Who I have on the bench? Uh, this guy. Just to leash the time. Come on, boys, end it. I mean, we won here without a few important players, with shitty players actually playing. Like this one, you see who was playing my right back? Because I didn't have any option. And now we have Braga again in the three days, so I need to give the rest. I need to give the rest to entire squad. We have also Benfica at home. We need to beat Benfica at, uh, at home. Because you see, they have a lot of these uh, less games and now they are coming very near to me. Even Sporting has two games less. <sighs> they are not dropping the points. Okay, Estevez is back. Keep on the bench. And Viti is back. Oh. And this fucker is on this African shit. So I'm playing without him in the big games. 
And I don't have anything around the bench in case of injuries. I mean, in this game, I'm a, I'm again favorite. And again, I gave them penalty. Need to change the tactic. Yeah, I don't have any striker on the bench. Areza is five months injured, and the fucking uh, Guyana is an African Cup. So we are two goals down. I change the tactic. And maybe it's even better that I uh, that I'm out of the cup, considering the uh, situation with the team. Come on, boys! Can we score one before the half time? Yes, yes, we, we scored the one. And the second one. Come on, boys! So you saw what I done. I started badly, immediately I changed the tactic. There is, I mean, you can... If you don't want to change tactic, you can change instruction, but it's easier to change. Because you cannot keep do nothing and just losing badly. Uh, Pedrinho is, is dead, I will replace him with this guy. And Piton will take his spot as left back. I forget to use him as starter, but doesn't matter now. Actually, if I have another striker, probably I will go with two up front.
Ah! He needed to score this one. I'm putting whoever I can just to avoid second yellow card. Oh, uh, we lost. We lost in extra time. Ah, nothing. Yeah, it is 12 January, my birthday, yeah. So we have 8 days until next game, and that game probably will decide the title. If I win here, title is mine. If I lose, it will be hard. Especially I need to play against Sporting away. And I am without Arezzo and Guyana. I am playing two two main uh, main main players in the, in the in the team. This is all bullshit messages. I win! Mean, win! It's so important game. Oh, Gayan is back, but I lost this guy, so he needs to go there. Uh, Zay Carlos can go on the bench, Arezzo is still fucked. Piton is suspended. Very big game, boys. Very, very big. This is like six point game. If I win here, then I can even lose against Sporting. It's not so important. Inter! Well, he's actually contract expiring. No chance I'm selling him to Inter. This will be, he will get unsettled. I would like to, you see, he's, he's Portuguese and very good player for this league. I mean, I can ask, I can ask 10 million in the cash. And transfer date end of season. Because he will still play at this 10 million will help me to build a squad for the next year. Okay, this is this is what I'm asking. And this we will tick. Hello, hello. As you can see I am playing with Gil Vicente. And we are playing a very now biggest game of the season. I need to win here to cement the title. Uh, 
Actually, we defeated them in the first, in, the, in a way. Come on, boys. Fuck the Bafrika now. I just want that this Gomez is not get, get the card. I don't have on the bench any left back. And Guyana again is... Why fucking Winger is having 17 attributes for aggression? Every game he gets the card. Vertolian is their left back. Are we, are, yeah, we are on extended highlights. No highlights, boys. I mean, even draw is good for me. Especially if I avoid to lose against Sporting in a way. I will not uh, replace nobody for now. Just demanding more. Shit. Come on, cross! Fuck this Verto again. Pass. They're both uh, full backs are fucked. I'm putting him in and him. These are only decent bench options what I have. Come on, one goal, boys. Come on. 6.2 I'm afraid he will get the card the second one yellow come on fuck you Benfica Very, very tough game. But Benfica has zero target against me, boys. Zero, zero shots on the, the... First shot on the target. And they score the goal. What the bullshit is this one? I was playing actually good. And this is scripted for sure. Gayan is completely fucked. At least I didn't lose. Still seven points over. And one game less. I'm having now Pacos Ferreira then Sporting.
I lost and draw. I think I will change the tactic against Pakosh. I will start with the uh, modification tactic. I need to do something. Of course, I need to win now. Gerard, what are you doing? How are you? See, Vigo is here also. Vigo, yesterday I make uh, good money, 3,000 euro from betting. I my last game was waiting uh, Italy-Argentina, at least two goals in the game. Exactly at the end of the first half time, we won it. Who is now calling me all the time? Fucking sporting six points, boys. I must not to lose against sporting. Is Ares already still no? All season I'm playing without him. Five months. Okay, I'm already fucked, I see it. And now this guy is also injured. I need to use Guyana striker. Yeah, I need to change also the tactic. Uh, And I need to use this fucker to play. Where is this Cunha? Metlo Moral. What tactic you are playing with Huddersfield? Give me penalty early. There, no penalty, of course. Oh, okay. He missed empty goal. Uh, I'm not playing good changing changing the tactic immediately. And I will immediately replace him. Not happy at all. And we scored immediately. 
So Navarro is fucked, Arezzo is fucked. At least Gayan can play. I need to replace also this Estevez. Where he pass? I must say I'm disappointed yesterday because I was sure that Ukraine will beat Scotland. First of all, Scottish team is disaster. I mean, there is no even one good player there. And when I when I saw, I mean, their lineup is really bad. There is no any good technical midfielder. Look at shit. And then I was sure that Argentina will not lose against Italy. Argentina lost. 30, 31, 32 games didn't lose. And I feel this Argentina is much better than on the World Cup because now Romero is playing, Molina is right back. They are better defensively than before. And that is the fact. Yeah, but uh, left back, what he can do? Nothing. They don't have strikers to score the goals, they don't have midfielders to control the game. I mean, you can have the world top goalkeeper and best defenders, you will never win nothing. Plenty, now it's the game uh, between Japan and Paraguay. They are playing. Uh, and tonight there is a League of Nations. That's why, for example, Croatia is so dominant, because they have best midfielders in the world. Brozovic, Modric, Kovacic is the strongest midfield trio now. And 2018 was uh, Rakitic instead of Kovacic. Kovacic was the bench. No other team have that kind of midfielders. These three are the best. I'm saying in the from the national teams. And that is the thing. If you have good midfielders, you control the game, you can do everything. Man United, Matic, Fred, Pogba, very bad. If if United is having better midfielder, midfielders they they will fight for the title. Because they will control the game, Maguire will be le less exposed, and they have strikers to score the goals. Maybe you don't agree with me. Okay, sporting draw, very good. But that is the fact. Rejecting, he's my backup. Central defender. I need today to arrange the tickets because Monday is playing uh, Croatia France here where I'm living in split. So I need to I need to arrange the tickets. If not, I will buy in the black market. I'm going to watch that game. Ah uh, shit, I forget it. I want to give the squad two days rest.
That's why I'm not a big fan of the Liverpool also, because Klopp, Klopp uh, doesn't help, I mean, the type of midfielder is what he is using, I don't like. I mean, Henderson uh, and this company, Milner, disaster. For me also, the reason why the Spain was so dominant for 10 years was Busquets, Xavi, Iniesta. These three were dominating to other teams. So in this game, just uh, just that I avoid avoid defeat. In uh, 30 minutes are playing South Korea, Brazil. Let me let the check the lineups. Paqueta, Richardson, Rafinha, Neymar, Casemiro, Fred. Alexandro, Marquinhos, Thiago, Silva, Dani Alves. Dani Alves is playing, fuck. Can't move. Thiago Silva playing also. Very bad in forward back. Goalkeeper, Weverton. Korea with Son and plus two strikers. Is this a real Son? Yeah, it is actually. I don't know where they are playing. It's is it somewhere in Europe or it's actually in Korea? It will be goals in that game. Finally, he's uh, ready. Seven days time out. Flu, flu, flu. The bad thing is my best central defender is fucked. This guy doesn't have morale. Yo. Okay, I will revert to my standard tactic. Navarro is fucked. Uh, Arezzo will start after five months, boys. Uh, for now, yes, but uh, I'm playing now the game against Sporting. If I lose here, the, I will still need to fight for the title. If I win here, I will win the title. Injur injuries are fucking me. So this guy is now after five months he will play. This is issue. Low morale. 
and he needs to play. I don't have nobody because Lawrence is suspended or injured. I mean, shit. And uh, my uh, wing backs, full backs, they cannot play this role. Even him cannot play, too short. <sighs> okay, uh, let's hope we can score ja more goals. Japan, Paraguay currently 0-0. Zero, zero. But uh, Japan is dominating. Today is interesting game for betting between Serbia and Norway. Uh, Serbia Vlahovic is not playing. So that means uh, Mitrovic will play a striker supported by Dusan Tadic and Milinkovic Savic. And I think Serbia will, uh, will try to win this game. So the best lineup will play. So I think that's the game to bet because Norway defense sucks. Never mind Holland and Odegaard. Oh, you see Japan score. Come on, boys. One more goal. I Last night I bet 150 euro to win 150. I bet... Uh, USA, Morocco over goals, Japan, Paraguay over goals, and uh, Brazil, Korea over goals. So we will see if can I win this. Shit. I started badly, I already see it. You see, zero shots on the target. Sporting just better. Well, we will see. I still cannot recover from that day when the Switzerland knocked out fucking France. I needed that game to advance. You know, you see statistic very poor. Um, so I will take risk, I will play with two strikers all in. Uh, I need to focus to score in this game. And that game was uh, destroyed me. I mean, not only they considered two goals in five minutes. Come on, at least draw, boys. Of course, now with uh, two strikers up front, I lost one midfielder, and uh, this is uh, this will not work against them. They they have just too much reputation for me. And they are fucking dominating me. I need to change the tactic again. So I changed to third tactic. Okay, this game we lost, but uh, I think until end, we don't need to play against any old big trio. I play against all of them. We will check the schedule after this one. And I think we only lost two games in the season. Against Braga away and uh, I think this one we will lose.
And now this fucker is also injured. Six point two. I mean, this is the reason why I lose the game. This player here. <sighs> that is the key reason how I lost this game. Central defender with poor morale. I needed to put fucking uh, one of these uh, full backs to play this role. This was my biggest mistake. I mean, the game is lost. I still have five points over. And better goal difference, so... How is my schedule? You see? There is no Benfica, Sporting, Braga or Porto. Only smaller teams. Uh, I need to give the rest again, at least three days. <laughs> 